Oop, let me turn down alerts. Wait, what 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 did you say? Oh, there's no message. Okay. Let me adjust the Discord audio before I unmute. Let's see here. Hello. Hi. Oh, I gotta turn you up. Hello, I'm going hello. To the bathroom. Yo. You're in the bathroom? I'm going to the bathroom. Okay, good luck. Okay, better be fast. Yeah, you're going to miss the first two seconds of the Incredible Classroom Experience. Oh, man. That the is the, the Incredible Classroom Experience. That is the egg first. Experience? The egg experience. Oh, dear. Oh. Yep. That is the that is the first the first tape of tonight's tapes. Uh, they're all relatively short, like 10, 15 minute tapes. The experience might be the longest one. I think it's like 16 minutes. Uh, I don't know much about it aside from the fact that I think it's, uh, kids doing a presentation about eggs or something like that. Hell yeah. Um, so anyone who, who not, oh, I'll have to turn my phone off. Anyone who doesn't uh, know much about eggs is in for a treat. And everyone, people who know things about eggs, you just get to validate your own understanding of eggs. So this will be a review. Yeah, everyone, everyone gets to, everyone gets to gain something from this. I'm seeing people saying, "I know everything about eggs." Who stole the egg? I don't know if we're gonna find out who stole the egg tonight. That is a, what is that emote? Hamster egg. Okay. So that's the first tape. That's there's there's quite a few as usual. A lot of the tapes tonight are going to be educational. Some of them preventative. Some of them just general knowledge. Uh, there's a there's one that I'm very much looking forward to that I think is right after the the classroom experience tape that I personally hope to gain a lot from. So we'll find out what that one is at that point. But yeah. I think if everyone's ready, we could hop into the incredible classroom experience. Do you have a oh side boy. stream? Oh, yes. I do have one right here. Boy, oh boy, tapes. Oh boy, oh boy. It is time. Let me, let me begin the experience. Let's see it. I'm liking this so far. The, hey, I don't wait, know what the edible egg this. is. Yeah, no, egg's oh, okay. I don't remember. I don't remember this. I don't remember this, but I remember the incredible edible egg. It was like, what's that? It was like the egg version of Got Milk. Uh huh. Some foods are high in protein. Like uh, like an ad campaign for eggs? Yeah, like so. they're trying to get people to have all eat more eggs. Amino acids that we need, so that makes them incomplete. How about some foods with complete proteins? Anyone? Yes, Sarah. Yes, I'm Can right. Like this is going to be talking protein? about how eggs are good for you. Well, um, <laughs> well they I are good fish. for you. Yes, Sarah, that's right. And don't forget about eggs. Thanks, People Carlos. are saying the video is quiet. Yeah, I think this tape is a bit quiet. I, I boosted it, but you're going to hear a lot of noise if I boost it more. Yeah. Okay, class. Good job. Remember, next time you'll be working in teams on your health and nutrition presentations. You can use any format you'd like. We got a kitchen. It is a kitchen. Charts and graphs. A multimedia presentation. Just use your imagination. Oh, how about a video? Like a cooking show. A cooking show. I think that's a great idea, Robert. I'd love to see your team do that. And for the rest of you, as I said, well, the noise use just your stopped. imagination. Yeah, yeah I, I, I put noise suppression on it. Oh, it's how cool. you present oh, nice. it. It's quality, not just quantity. Knowing this class's creativity, I'm looking forward to your projects. It wouldn't surprise me if you all earn A's. 
Wow, that's a great, that's a very positive class. Oh, I'm gonna get an E for egg. What were you thinking? I don't know anything about cooking. Yeah, Robert, exactly what were you thinking? None of us is some great chef. Yeah, I can't even boil water without burning it. Ask my mom, she's already given up on me. Terrific. Hey, guys, I think you're overreacting here. <laughs> no, really. <laughs> this will be great. Listen, it'll be easy. It'll be fun. <laughs> I don't. Who acts like that? I can't believe Just look at this oh, egg. Egg, egg freaks. This will be easy. It'll be this will be fun. easy. Easy. Some fun. Hey, come on, you guys. What's with this attitude? Robert, listen to me. I can't cook anything. I mean, I know how to work the toaster, and I can warm stuff up in the microwave, but that's it. And you, Maria? I don't oh, you can do so much cooking in a microwave. Guys. So how about it, Robert? Do you cook? Well, um, not really. I mean, I, I think that, oh, great. Three people with no earthly idea how to cook doing a cooking show for a grade, no less, when all we had to do was make some cool posters or something. But no, thanks to you, Mr. Kitchen Genius, Miss Watkins is now expecting some cooking show. No. They're going in on him. This get his will ass. Be great. Trust me on this, okay? This guy is a plant. <laughs> okay? <laughs> hey, come on, guys. Wait up. <laughs> That's very Michael J. Fox. Susan. Come on, guys. Come on, Susan. guys. Sorry. I've got it. Got what? Eggs. Eggs. <laughs> Hell yeah. Man. Hell yeah. Do a presentation on eggs. Think about it. Eggs are easy to cook, and there's lots of ways to fix them. See? You mean just fried eggs? Boiled eggs. Fried. Hard cooked, not boiled. Oh, you don't say boiled? Scrambled. Poached. Baked. What? Omelets. Quiches. Pancakes, uh, See, the thing eggs, about this ad campaign potatoes, souffle, that, like, custards. I don't really get oh, is this was all like cookies, the cookies, Got pies. Milk came first, right? Got Milk Man. came first, and Got That's Milk was like hungry. insanely so, successful. Do you guys love like, eggs? People started Robert, drinking a lot more milk more than they needed to because of the Got Milk ad campaign. So other well, industries I've started getting on the same thing. There was the Beef It's What's for Dinner campaign. That oh, was yeah. less successful. I don't know. Yeah, they had no, that. Really? Remember, remember those right. commercials yeah. that had like the orchestral music, like. And they're like, beef, it's what's for dinner. And like, okay, sure. And they had this one called the Incredible Edible Egg that was like, hey, eggs are good for you and they're healthy too. And it's like, but the thing that I don't get is that. Like, people eat a lot of eggs already. <laughs> Net girl strike like, again. They can always eat more. Oh, they can always eat more. All right, yeah, they can always what eat do you want the more. About eggs? Well, why do they, uh, why do they put the emphasis on it being you know, edible? Like where they come from. The I think, think they, they just wanted something eggs. that rhymed. Uh, well, some people may not know. They right. hadn't that established the facts yet. This was this yeah. video is much like well, the nobleman that ate a tomato in public. Chickens, Robert. <laughs> laying hens Let's to be specific. Let's demystify oh, the egg. According to this, there are millions of laying hens in egg farms all across the country, and it says that today's production practices result in consistently high quality, nutritious eggs. <laughs> During processing, they're washed, sanitized. Wow, the entire Yo. product has been done for you by this website. <laughs> the, quality. the egg, the egg, yeah, just like turn this in. machine. And that the eggs we buy today are fresher, fresher than, than ever. ever, thanks to modern Hell packaging yeah. and shipping methods. All right, did you get all that? Am I supposed to be writing this down? Oh, brother. It's all right. I'm saving it all to disk anyway. <laughs> okay, we got wow. it. What's next? Wow. How about nutrition? Okay, That's the first time I've heard anyone say that they saved a website to a disc. Okay, here we go. 
Oh god. Hey, look at what this. Was that? I don't know, but that didn't look That was a good. stank. Yeah, that's the <laughs> famous egg stank. That's why egg protein is used as a like, standard to measure This whole chat, get ready. This yeah. whole video, I don't know how long it is, but it's going to be just wow. all about They're hyping so up eggs. Protein. They're in the meat group and the food guy. I'm for it. They're See? part of eggs. meat. That makes them A single cool. large egg provides a significant amount of riboflavin. I can't read any of that. Nope. And look at all these nope. other nutrients on this these tables. They can just read oh. anything. You could almost live on eggs alone, huh? Well, no, not really. <laughs> no single food has everything that our body needs, but eggs are nutrient dense. See, wow, this is making me crave like hard boiled eggs I have in the fridge. Calories. Eggs are so <laughs> good. You could basically just live off of see. just eggs. You could just keep buying it. <laughs> yeah. It says here that one large egg has five grams of fat. That's that's about a teaspoonful. The fat in an egg you is made up of almost your wallet, exactly go down the, the store, buy about three eggs. Type. Thirty-one percent polyunsaturated. Oh, this is back during the, the whole fat thing. And oh yeah, yeah, they oh, were yeah. really worried about fat back cholesterol? then. An average large egg contains two hundred and thirteen milligrams of cholesterol. It also says that too much total fat, and especially too much saturated fat, fat is the oh, villain. Two most important fat is the villain. Oh fat. no! Heart disease. Oh, too oh much no! Cholesterol is a distant third. So, unless your body has trouble processing cholesterol, eating eggs shouldn't be a problem. So eggs can be <laughs> awesome. Diet. You know, with all this information, there is no way we're gonna get less than an egg. I'm surprised they never tried to come up with a skimmed so sure, egg. Robert, you guys still have to teach me <laughs> no, how to That's a scary oh, thought. Right. Eating an egg. Peace oh, so it turns cake. out that unless <laughs> your your body sucks, you can eat as many eggs as you want. Yep, I guess. Pretty, well, you can do pretty much anything you want if your body doesn't suck. Right like, here. Here we go. You can just eat eggs. It says that in addition yeah. to being served on their own, eggs perform many important Yes, meringue, functions. sure. <laughs> All right. Egg white, yolk, and whole egg foam serve to lighten controversial but I think meringues are the worst use of an egg. The... Heat, egg protein, okay, coagulate. here's what I'm talking about. That's how eggs help bind together. The human, the human race as a whole and <laughs> already eats a lot of sauce. eggs. Like, if you think about it, we use eggs in a lot of eggs, things. Like, it is. It's like, an essential it's ingredient. Like, it's an emulsifier. Yeah, it's an essential ingredient for multiple cultures and like multiple peoples around the world. Like, mayonnaise. humans eat a fuck ton of eggs, and chat. Eggs I, I don't know why the they have this ad campaign, because, like... In I don't think it works because I don't think like Some humans were already eating a fuck ton of eggs. I don't like. I guess they were hoping that we'd like what pop pop eggs in our mouths like candy. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. Just come home from school being like, I could go for an egg before dinner. Yeah, like, I could go for an egg. <laughs> Everything in my mouth. looks great. <laughs> Afraid of missing ready to get started? So. They thought that okay. everybody's okay. just gonna uh, drink milk instead of eggs forever. <laughs> oh, oh, maybe that. Oh, you're right. Maybe it was the combat that got sure milk campaign. Uh, we were drinking milk. Milk, milk, milk could eggs. possibly help to replace <laughs> eggs. Yeah. He's washing his hands in milk. There you go. After you're done. <laughs> All right. Now we are ready for the eggs. And we should remember that we need to keep the eggs in the refrigerator until we are ready to use them. His shirt is giving me Paul Martin vibes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, a little bit. See this number? I mean, people just dressed like garden. this back then. That number stands oh. for the day of the year that the eggs were packed. So, for instance, the number one would stand for January 1st and 365 for December 31st. It's called the Julian date. Bet you didn't know that. <laughs> and you can keep what? the eggs in the refrigerator up to four to five weeks after that date. Well, now these are grade double That's A large eggs that we're Julian using. Days. See the grade and the size is right there on top of the <laughs> Grade platter. double other A grades large and size eggs. Are all I don't think I've ever bought yeah. graded eggs. And did you know that other than the shell they're graded color, over here. No I mean, they're all eggs are graded. Yeah, eggs. yeah. At least yeah every, well, every carton sure of eggs. eggs in, in, I've, I've never seen them on the packaging. It's always Is that something they do in Canada? Is that something they only do in the U.S.? Maybe it's somewhere else. I don't oh. think they do them here. Uh, is our is our egg lesson over? Hold on a second. No a more egg. Oh, oh. the second top in the eggs. Then you add just enough butter or cooking oil to lightly 
coat the pants. Right. And, cool. and, 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 and for, and for the naysayers in chat, as long as your body's away. okay, you don't have to worry about the cholesterol from What's any eggs. <laughs> if you eat eggs, you can eat anything, but also Simply. just eat eggs and milk. Wash your yeah, hands and milk. You can eat eggs. Yeah, and if you got a healthy body, you don't have to worry about anything, any of the cholesterol you intake, but, but just eat eggs. So you can eat, you can eat all the creme brulee you want. And make yeah. sure the dessert eggs. has okay. eggs in it. Your drinks mixture. have eggs in it. Or even simpler, just add a teaspoon or so of water, and then cover what the, the pan. Fuck? The egg I mean, is done do when the white is completely set and the yolk has begun to thicken. But it's not hard. Then you just slide it onto a plate. Maybe add some parsley and enjoy. <laughs> it's so easy. <laughs> awesome. And that is not sure. a bad looking egg if I do say so myself. Yeah. <laughs> do you guys think you can handle the scrambled egg part? Yeah, I think so. All right. I'm going to see what it looks like from behind the camera. Man, I don't know what the deal right. is. First like, all, for Robert is, is a teacher character, but is presented as a student. Okay, that's melted yeah. Butter. Yeah, definitely. He's, okay. he's now, the egg expert. Two eggs. These are all college students pretending to be high school. Oh, no, 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 no. Well, okay. Maybe now, these two can be college students. Robert's like 32. Yeah. <laughs> just like that, that's great. Robert teaches right. statistics. Is the, is the edible egg is. plant in the school. Collusion. 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 They're using milk and eggs. See, you can do this. <laughs> now take the pancake turner. I'll take that. And gently Love these, move the egg mixture around. These actresses pretending that they've never, okay, they don't yeah. know how to make a scrambled egg. Doing that. It's like, oh, uh, so you don't see any more Is this a completely. distinct tool? A pancake turner? Is this not a spatula? And I, think we've got <laughs> yeah, I don't know why they call it a spatula. pancake turner. Pretty see, sure that's called a spatula. Maybe that was their that attempt at like student fying yeah, them. Yeah, but I'm still worried about the omelet. Can just I grab your collapsible grabber and only get the, get the egg really over turn, please. So let's get ready. I love you the, the meat pyramid food. on the fridge right, there. Susan, don't worry, I'm gonna be right here next to you. Okay. That's the, the All food right, pyramid. Here's a new pan and a pancake turner. That's the old food pyramid. And we're ready to go. I still okay. don't know why they changed you guys it. Ready? We're calling it Maslow's hierarchy of ready, eggs. Ready. All right. <laughs> I am rolling. Today we're going to tell you about the incredible There's battery indicator. I don't know what that's supposed to be. About how nutritious eggs are, how they can be used in lots of dishes, and how to cook them. To begin, that's how close they are to a master animal charge. We discovered that an egg is a natural, nutrient-dense food. We have discovered very high quality, and they're quite delicious. The egg is the egg is very high quality. But you can use cooking spray if you want to cut down on fat. New types of eggs are being now, discovered every day. Denver <laughs> We're now cooking some ham, onions, and peppers until the vegetables are tender. Some? So few. Wow, that's so so few <laughs> additions. To, that's eggs, like half an omelet. That is, this is like their sixth tape take, and they're running out of ingredients. <laughs> <laughs> oh together. my god. They had to ration the one pepper for Good the job. last seven takes. Here you go. Now that they're blended together, we're gonna take the beaten egg mixture and pour it listen, into the if you're, pan. Listen, if you're trying to maximize to egg mixture. to filling now, for your omelet, that's what it's gonna look like. Yeah, that's and true. She's gonna gently pull the I mean, eggs are so good. I come, sometimes I just eat plain omelets with nothing in them because the eggs are just so tasty. Yeah, I mean, we just put the vegetables in because we have to. This way, all of the egg mixture gets cooked. She's gonna keep pulling and tilting until there's no more uncooked egg mixture. If you want, you can make a plain omelet. It looks like she's just petting it. it. Whatever cooked <laughs> foods you like. There, there. Ours is almost finished, though. Now, there, there, noble to do egg. Is take the pancake turner, fold the omelet over, and that's it. The omelet is done. I don't like to omelets. To serve your omelet, just slide it out of the pan and onto a plate, and then it's ready to weird. eat. We hope that you learned a lot about eggs today, oh, I enjoy and we hope an that you'll try occasionally. cooking them yourself. It's like a egg. Mm, sandwich, this is good, the is the bread. and they really are easy to you know, cook. I've been a big fat, fan of they're just an just omelet, omelet rice, though. That's they're good incredible. Shit. They're edible. They're <laughs> eggs. <laughs> yes. <Yeah, it's good laughs> <laughs> they're incredible. They're edible. It's like a, it's like a. Susan I really, Maria. you know, they wanted something that rhymed. Right, it's, they, it's they wanted they wanted something nice that rhymed, job. and they wanted to use the Very the nice word indeed. incredible. So like that's what they went with, oh, thanks, but like the the like really it's good. bad to say that they're edible. It makes it, 
It makes it sound like it makes it sound like you're trying to sell a new food to an alien race, <laughs> as opposed to <laughs> inedible eggs. You guys did a good job. Yeah. <laughs> you wow. Guys did a good you job. you sure cooked I those eggs? Be great, and you were. <laughs> Look, you, you got your <laughs> edible eggs that everyone knows about, but then you got your inedible we eggs, like a Faberge egg. Mm -hmm. You got <laughs> it. You got <laughs> the fresh egg. Through. Yeah. Marketing works. Marketing edible, works. edible egg. A E V. The American Egg Board. Yeah, look at American <laughs> Egg Board. <laughs> the American Egg Board paid for this. Holy shit! There's an American Egg Board. Is there? Is there an American is. Milk Board? Yeah. I wonder, if, I wonder if there's still an American Egg Board. There, there, for a lot of like the agricultural stuff in America, there is like an organization that like represents the entire industry <laughs> big egg that was fun that was funded by big egg oh they have one of these fucking modernized websites i was hoping it would be old and shitty the american egg board it's There's just an american it's, beef board it, it yes, redirects that's, you. Why they, that's why they had the beef like like it's not they're not like it wasn't like a specific company it was like yes it was just the ads were just like Eat beef for dinner. We want you to eat more beef for dinner. We don't care what beef you buy from which company. Please. Just eat more beef. Just Please drink buy more, more beef. Milk. Just eat more eggs. Is there an American broccoli board? I don't know. Maybe. Can we find that out? I'm wondering what they what what kind of foods are picked. Broccoli probably. is probably too little. Not it nearly, ha, it not nearly a staple food. I I would say it's more for like the animal based the ones, board. right? Like there could probably. be probably. It's probably yeah. more. It, they're probably like. Oh wait, no, there is one for potatoes. I remember during the nineties, there was also a campaign to get people to eat more Idaho potatoes specifically. <laughs> wow. Uh, I, I wish I could that. find a video related. I want to watch a potato. A, a video selling me on eating Idaho potatoes. It's three. It's three students trying to find as many things you can do with potatoes as possible for their <laughs> school. But project. only the Idaho kind. Only, only the Idaho. Idaho kind. And they and then they're in Florida, so they have to go all the way to Idaho to get them. There's a flat. There's a cut of footage of them stomping on sweet potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> Don't accept yams. Don't accept sweet potatoes. Accept no substitutes. All right, that was that was big big eggs uh, sponsorship of the stream. We were that was I was commissioned by the American Egg Board and Big Egg to show that video, and big uh, egg. now we know what a Julian date is. <laughs> big and egg, how old eggs are, and uh, to that we that we can't say boiled, or hard boiled. We have to say hard cooked or something like that. Apparently, they every time someone said boiled in that, they would correct them and say hard cooked. That yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe there was like, like anxiety weird, over like, like the fact that a boiled, thing. like over the fact that a boiled egg is not like cooked or something like that. Yeah, it's probably like some weird regulatory thing that they like legally can't say. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so strange. Okay, well, they they shot they shot a cooking video in there, and their camera work left a lot to be desired, and so I think they would have liked to watch this next tape. Oh, goody. Oh? Oh? Oh, hell oh, yeah. Oh, fuck yeah. So this is the tape. I mean, you're going to see exactly what it is. How to make a video letter. <laughs> awesome. Fuck oh, yes. To actual ah. shooting. Hell yeah. Video letter. Wow. Awesome. <laughs> this is how I want my memories to be cherished. Video movie is simplicity itself. Anyone can use it to shoot. It was repeated wiping across the screen. <laughs> Moments of my life flashing Everyone likes before to my have eyes. Vivid visual memories of their family <laughs> and to keep them for as long as possible. This is someone before they dying fly in moment. front of their eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's watching this kid. Okay. 
Of course, it's a pleasure to shoot interesting subjects and scenes, but it's even better to be able to play back one's own movies in the way only video makes possible. <laughs> this is kind of meta. This is this is like a VHS viewing about VHS viewing. This is the one we yep. took, uh... That's Last true. week when we were camping at the river. These were cool. I think she's like really the, going to the little baby tapes you put into the big tape players to put them in the yeah. VHS. Yeah. A video movie also I have a couple makes of home movies that are on these. Gift for friends and relations. Yeah, you I think my parents had one that works that kind of way. Uh, my JVC letter information <laughs> package. <laughs> 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 JVC yeah, like, to my family. Yeah, did they have specific envelopes? <laughs> it seems like it. Oh my god, I didn't know that. Oh, Jesus. That just looks like a regular ass Manila envelope. But it's like, yeah, yeah. but it's like JVC JVC branded. JVC in the branded. That's true. That doesn't fit at all. <laughs> and any like... grandmother would be delighted to receive such a tape, wouldn't she? <laughs> <laughs> would she? <laughs> oh, awesome. It's not even really playing on the TV. <laughs> they like, they've like the overlaid it. Oh yeah, all, all of these have been uh, overlaid. So she'd know how you really feel about oh, her. God. Actually, Grandma has a male living space. <laughs> <laughs> She's about to play one, one chair on TV. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so, I mean, some some retirement Basic homes are not very lavish. Much more interesting to look at. Let's take a look at some of them. Kids like cut the film, cut the camera film. work. I'm loving the music yeah, the and the visuals. Why don't you see that? Let's this fucking how to hold the camera. Yeah, so the the these. The like visuals on the tile slides are like um Japanese karaoke like <laughs> machine <laughs> yeah. visuals. With your left hand, oh hell yeah, put the hand underneath. Gently gently rest it with your right hand. I'm gonna do this next time I'm filming something. Now you're holding the camera steady. <laughs> like grab it with one hand and then very gently rest your second hand on it. God, that would mess Dude, up. Gotta be fucking, safe. The fucking music on this tape is so good. It's it's amazing. When you need That's to move, very ominous. The camera or shoot yeah. What are they doing? They're just watching <laughs> They're the ball. They're moving a ball back open. and forth. Stable picture. <laughs> Don't do this. The camera is wrong and will cause the picture to tilt. <laughs> It'll cause the oh, picture to bad. tilt. Bad. <laughs> what? What? It's not the <laughs> Show this to every a German filmmaker. The camera level is <laughs> vertical and horizontal Bad. lines in the shooting field and Bad. just follow them. Oh no. Good. Good. <laughs> Good. To keep the camera stable, hold it firmly without moving your body. Or else try to place it on a level surface. Oh, if you have a spare director's chair. <laughs> Image size. <Yeah. laughs> Oh, Another classic American hot dog. <laughs> eating eating a hot dog on a fucking lake <laughs> riverbed. <laughs> the <face laughs> or body is left outside the frame. The result is an unattractive picture. <laughs> That's such a good fucking screen cap. Good. As good. Much as possible, There's a lot of good screen caps. To shoot lively expressions yeah. or figures in action and choose an image size which suits that particular subject. My shirt. She's drinking that like a hamster. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Remember <laughs> not to include unnecessary Bye. elements in the picture which might distract the viewer from the main subject. <laughs> all, this will detract from the mise en scene. <laughs> Camera work. Now try moving the camera as you shoot so as to add variety and movement to the scene. Start That's off by moving the camera sideways. Keep the lower uh -huh. half of your body steady and She's an expert now. That is a first physically impossible. I would not be able to pull that off. That's so slow. Okay, now you're ready to start shooting. She took a uh, whatever Don't that is that sniper's take. Too quickly or too slowly. <laughs> Try to settle on a speed. Start with a D. I, I really have to get this shot. Dice pan, dice pan. Starting to panning for Make your husband do this over and over again. <laughs> and stop slowly. <laughs> it's not like he's catching any fish anyway, like why not? 
When you start show it's, it's, for a few seconds, he's just practicing his cast. The then when you he's stop weird sideways camera, cast. For a few seconds more it's like fly fishing. You cast. He casts it like a, he's, okay. he's letting the Beyblade rip. Yeah, a little bit. What are they doing? Bad. Bad, bad, apparently. They're doing bad. <laughs> Not, they're doing badly. Some space in the frame ahead of the subject so that the picture looks natural. Good. Good. Even the way they're carrying the baby was different. These are like filmmaking rules, not like, here's how to shoot your video of your family. <laughs> yeah. The same technique. Like, who cares? Just get a video your wrist. of your That must hurt your wrist so well. much. Yeah. Flower. The JVC <laughs> compact video movie can zoom in and out on the subject without your having to change your shooting position. But this bad, the bad looks family. All wrong, oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> While you're learning, the trick is to compose your zoomed-in picture in the viewfinder first. These are and then zoom these in guys the are just afterwards. shitting on our Faxmas filming techniques. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> when you start yeah, shooting, we never held the camera like that. At first and then pull up. Good because zoom. we have tripods. <laughs> Now that looks just fine. We have tripods. We <laughs> have equipment. Just fine. We didn't need to hold the cameras. Remember that what matters most in movie making is to create a true representation of the scene you want to see or show to others. So take care not to blur the zoomed-in subject or zoom in on it too fast. Like you'd be able to tell from a fucking old ass movie. <laughs> yeah. Finder, unless you really knew what you were doing. <laughs> Very much. <laughs> techniques of camera Yo, what's this jingle? Let's turn this is so fucking intense. Video it's like a fighting <laughs> game level. It's like one step beyond happy hardcore. <laughs> <laughs> Making a video movie is just the same as writing a letter. Ecstatic yeah, hardcore. You decide on your subject. Euphoric hardcore. Subject. It's then the same as writing a letter. Angles, image sizes, Everyone that and they, camera that movies. they film. Plus, of course, shooting with that camera looks like will be. they are. There's something wrong. It, like they come off very creepy because of how they hold the camera and they move so slow. Hey! With these points in mind, let's start shooting. Yeah. I just realized something. Uh huh. I think I know why this yes, is so awkward. Yeah. Oh God, the kids. Uh, is is a Japanese see. company, right? Yeah. Here's a full frame shot of a they birthday shot this in Japan. Making the picture take up the whole frame. <laughs> the the okay. of the scene he was so happy earlier. What happened to him? That kid hates to show expression vividly. Try mm -hmm. a close up of one of the main characters. Okay. Okay. You want to know what? You want to know what gave it away? Change the image size from time to time and the continue cake. shooting at a good lively that, tempo. That cake gave it away. I don't know what what what, what is up with that cake. But that cake came from As a Japanese see, bakery. <laughs> I think this is so awkward because this is shot in Japan. This is shot in Japan, right? I don't know. Celebrate his birthday. I think it's just this, as likely. Okay, this is shot in Japan. JBC got as many Hi, American Hi. expats who Say wanted hi. to act in the video as they could. And so it's a bunch of... But they couldn't get everyone who's an American. So they got a bunch of foreigners, and not all of them speak English, and that's why that kid is so sad. <laughs> I don't know. That's a oh, what? family oh, okay. is one of those important events that everybody wants to remember. Okay, here we are in beautiful Asakusa Temple in downtown Tokyo. Oh, it's really great to be here. Oh, James. <laughs> <laughs> oh, extremely oh. dubbed over. Oh, oh, Hi, it's great so to be here. Be here. Oh. I was right! I was right! Yeah, the thing the thing is, uh, JVC stands for uh, Japan Video Cool. Yeah, I did. Yeah. <laughs> Japan Video I knew JVC was a Japanese company. Family while they're all walking along. I, I figured they might have, like, outsourced yeah. it to America. Yeah. Yeah. It, it's super awkward because, like, not every, like, in their fake family, not but everyone just speaks the, the same members language. The they just got whoever, like, they just got, like, anyone who looked white. 
so you know, make sure you get there are a lot of American, like, I think, I think you could find, like, a, a full family of, like, Americans in it's fair. Japan. Okay, like, fair. Just, like... Fair. Okay, good point. Fair. But they're not all, but they're not all actors. When you see something interesting. And so they're yeah. all awkward. Like this. Yeah, I, I think that's, that's the more likely thing. I love so, but, moving so but, weird. But that cake. This that cake the was a dead giveaway. Because that was a Japanese back. ass birthday party. Three hundred dollars. What the heck are they talking about? Creativity to your video letter. That was a Japanese cowbell? ass cake. No, but no Western Today's family has a birthday so party with fruit. For all the family. <laughs> yeah, you think you think an American three-year-old is gonna have a birthday party with no Thomas the Tank Engine? No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and milk that and is, eggs. That is a, that is a, that is a super Asian thing. Like, oh, it's your this birthday. Is, what is this food? viewing area? <clears throat> They're like looking uh, the, at the, a, the, a space the, in the wall. Uh, the easiest to composite. That's what. Yeah. Our living room is just a blank wall with a hole in it where there's a TV. <laughs> the tape's yeah. now ready to be sent off to Granny. In American uh, music. <laughs> oh yeah. Anyone can become a good cameraman by mastering the basic techniques so required for operating the camera and learning the knack the music of knowing is, like, what the to shoot is and weird. how the music to shoot is always very loud. That way, you can hold on to vivid memories of important or enjoyable events and occasions wherever and whenever they take place. <laughs> so now wow. you've got the hand it's really video. to make a video letter that you really <laughs> enjoy. Oh, you know, I, wa I really want to see a green screen version of Grandma Reaction. Put a, a That'd be very easy to make. <laughs> That'd be very easy. From daily life, a party. A journey. The number of subjects and opportunities is unlimited. And by conveying your feelings and impressions in a video letter, you can really stay close to friends and relations who live far away. Awesome. I wish I could find the music for this. Just yeah. That was great. I swear, I'm I'm sure there's somebody who has used those beats in 2018 or later. Yeah, probably. Probably. I saw people in chat mention that they're working on the, yeah, the isolated gra grandma reaction. I can't wait to see. <laughs> That's gonna be some prime vid. Okay, let me check. So they definitely didn't use any of those rules shooting the incredible egg video. So they didn't they never watched that video. They th they mentioned at some point in that first video that they added water to the egg. And that got me thinking how how safe really are we near water? <laughs> and I think <laughs> And I think the answer uh, is we're not. I think, Difficult uh, question. I think we're due for some sort of uh you know, just a bit of information as to how we can really make sure that we're okay around water. So, and I, I, there's a, a, a nice character okay. that will help us through that so that we're not scared. Okay. You'll never know when a water attack comes. <clears throat> I'm, I'm near a lot of water right now, so if, if well, there's something I need to be worried about, I better... Yeah, don't, look, be... don't look directly at it. Oh, damn it. I, I think I did that, like, earlier today. Don't smile at it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can't. He'll view it as a predatory response. Starting. <laughs> <laughs> Starting with actually the whoa, banger whoa, of the intro yeah, cards. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. I couldn't read it Hell before because yeah. he was moving so much. Ooh. Hi there. Oh, holy <laughs> shit. Who's this freak? Oh this. my god. It's a water drop. Real we got a little Without freak me, here. There would be no life on Earth. Did you know that? Thanks to water, what? trees and plants and pretty flowers can grow. 
fish and frogs have a place to swim. They let somebody do way too much right now. <laughs> Yo, nice and cool frog. To drink when you're thirsty. So now you know how important water really is. But guess what? You can find me in different shapes, like a solid, ooh, a gas. <laughs> what a tutorial. Or a liquid. You'll see what no, we can't show liquid. All we don't have the need water. means to do a liquid effect. Being real important to us, water can also be a lot of fun. Especially when it's hot outside and you want to cool off. These kids sure have the right idea. We're going to learn how to be safe when we're around water. So we can have a good time like our friends here. You know, water can be loads of fun, nope. but hey, you didn't, hey, you didn't, you didn't move, you didn't move it over. Did you know that more than a <laughs> hundred people drown in Arizona They rendered it year? at the wrong resolution. That's because they made mistakes around water. They did things they weren't supposed to do. But I'm gonna show you how to. Wait, did it just say like how many deaths there were here? Water. Do we talk about that? I want to. Yeah, when I check drowning. Yeah. Ready? There's also a hole in his hand mesh topology that I can see. Yeah. They gave just like one also guy. Be dangerous. Yes. Did you know that more than a hundred people drown in Arizona every year? Arizona. 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 <laughs> they they oh, made mistakes. Arizona water also, video. Also, just straight up blaming them for the fact. Around water, so you yeah. can have a lot of fun and enjoy fucking, yourself. Fucking Are you ready? deadly Grand Canyonized water. Arizona is in the desert. You know, There's you no give no them a pool. Those Always those desert. Swim. People aren't gonna know what to do with swim it. Swim alone. This is real important to remember. You don't want to swim by yourself because what if you fell in the water by accident and you had to be rescued? There wouldn't be they anybody got so there little to help water you. in Arizona. They so don't know what make to sure do. They there's an adult close by before you go near the water. Okay? That brings us to my next rule: <laughs> Learn how to swim. It's easy. These kids are doing it, and you can too. <laughs> Number one tip on how to, how to swim, drown. Ask your parents to sign you up for swimming lessons. They're offered at pools all throughout the city. Knowing how to swim is the best way to make sure you won't drown. Which city? I thought now, this was Arizona. We're getting more and more water, like do what I'm fine doing tuned right here. Now. Relax. Be real calm and don't panic. Yeah, I don't know why Just do the why survival they out Arizona like specifically. This, <laughs> this might have been do made it in Arizona. Lying on your stomach. Or on your back. We'll probably find your that at the end. Will float naturally. Yeah. So just remember the water to board of Arizona. <laughs> Once you know how to swim, you can have a lot more fun in the water. But you have to be real careful about where you go swimming. And that brings me to another important rule. Always swim in safe places. Even though we live in a desert, there are lots oh. of lakes and pools. Yeah, oh, Arizona. Yeah, this, is, this is made for Arizona. Oh, look at those fucking suburban pools. Swim, as long as there's an adult with you. But fast-flowing rivers, deserted beaches, and canals are never safe for swimming. Canals are really dangerous, so you should always stay away from them. Come along with me and I'll show you why. <laughs> Up here on top, the <laughs> Here's a dead body. looks yeah. nice and smooth. But underwater, it's real dangerous. Look at all this stuff on the bottom that you can't see from up there. Tree branches, broken glass, all sorts of things that can hurt you. And if you fall into a canal, you raise your shirt choppy because part. the banks are so steep now. and slippery. So always stay no. away from canals. Watch out, That's kid. A bright oh, an animal or one of your toys oh, ends oh, in the canal, <laughs> don't go in after it. That's go so perfectly in the middle. <laughs> he jumps in and swims to now, it. Now, <laughs> for another important rule, learn how to help. If there's an emergency, go to the nearest telephone and dial 911. That's a real important dial. number to remember. 911. You got it? Good. Hi, I'd like to report an emergency. Help! Help! Now, what would you do if somebody else might be in trouble in the water? You can help them without jumping in. Just stay on the ground and throw them something that floats so they can hold that's on tired. to it. No, that's a a life preserver, raft, inner tube, anything that floats. Or you can give them the end of a towel or a pole. An egg. But make sure you don't fall an in too. An edible egg. Hope someone's drowning. And don't forget to tell an adult. 
While the adult is pulling oh, the person out of the water, you can go to the telephone Why is it there? and call the emergency oh, number for just, help. I thought he was just uh, running away. What was that number again? <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm drowning. I'm out of here. <laughs> and here's another rule to remember. Don't depend on things that float if you don't know how to swim. These floating toys and inner tubes can be a lot of fun to play with in the water. I like the implication by the drop that holding like a rubber dog that you could just throw yeah, someone a rubber dog cool and that would save the them. Than by jumping yep. in a swimming pool. Terrible <laughs> dive! <laughs> I love, I love watching kids bot so dive. Sure <laughs> Nothing funnier. And not the shallow end. Besides, you make a bigger splash that way. And while you're in the water, make sure you swim away from the diving boards and slides. That's a lot safer. Then once Make you're sure you swim away from the water. Walk on the pool deck. As fast as oh, possible. Oh, always you walk as we well have. I took that's swimming lessons fun. as a kid. They would yell at us all the time. Don't run. Every once in a yeah, while, it'll start yourself. raining, and we'll even get a thunderstorm. Ooh, great. Ooh, Whoa. That's spooky. That can also be dangerous if you happen to be swimming at the same time. So always stay out of the water whenever you see lightning Whose string or is hear this? thunder. Across the pool? They should, <laughs> it's like for water polo. Is that a they should net? talk about... Yeah, yeah, it's a net. Or it doesn't have a net, but it's supposed adult. to be a net. Yeah, it's kind of missing the net mean, bit. Don't like how the top smart. of his head moves like and that. You're <laughs> yeah. I really hate to see his nose from the side. <laughs> All right, Dewey, but what? Oh my God! It, it yeah, stuck you can on see the him. first frame at, the, at yeah. the top. That's awesome. Yeah. That's all right, Dewey, but what should we do when the haboob hits? <laughs> well, that character's name was Dewey. I think SRP. Someone says is a power company in Arizona. So yes, SRP. That would explain. It's a water Salt and River power project. company. So that would explain uh, why they why they well explain partially why they did this. And uh, on the on the topic of boards, I'm sure there's a corn board. So in honor of this corn board, what we're we getting got, a corn I've got, one. I've got a corn vid. <gasps> oh yes. no! Oh shit! Corn vids. The backbone of American agriculture. Oh, the corn. Shit. The incredible edible ear. <laughs> <laughs> We're streaming corn on Twitch. Let's go. Watch out. Tell your friends. Do you like? <laughs> top, top of the just chatting. Hi, everybody. I'm uh, Captain Corn. Oh, my turn it off, turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. Oh, yeah, okay, never mind. It's just like you. Who's this bolt man? <laughs> One of the most important <laughs> things raised by farmers in America. And today you're going to learn about one of the most important things farmers do with that corn. I love this. Turn dump. it into hamburgers. The person's just wildly steaks, gesturing. And yeah. chops and fried chicken Hold up, what the foreign humans also no, ripped. Turning corn into meat isn't magic. It's what farmers do every single day. Oh my but before fucking I give away god. Too much, Let's get started with our story. Is this is this about Billy growing corn as animal feed? Could very well be called a is this chocolate cart filled with bread? I think it's filled with yeah. meat. I think it's just yeah, about corn. corn in general. Yeah, corn, what? yeah! What? Wait. Is that what this is? Oh, I, this I think this is... Awesome. is... Okay. okay. Yeah, no, I think... That, I, I think this is about certain, like, corn as animal feed. Like, yeah. Yeah, corn! Yeah, corn! Okay, we get it. This is this is this yeah, is corn industry. Ohio corn marketing folder. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, they're upfront about this. Do do they need? I thought they were like so subsidized that something like this is just purely redundant. Like, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There might be a reason. Oh, big collaboration. Oh shit! This is this is like Wu Tang. It's they got everybody. <laughs> 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 The corn factory. This is aggressive lettering. Ohio and yeah. uh, Iowa, I think, are two big corn states. There's a lot of big corn states. Most of America's agriculture is uh, corn based. <laughs> yeah, that's the impression I got. If there were some kind of uh, 
corn-based pathogen or something that halted corn production, we'd be fucked. Oops. But Boy, Dad. What's, what's wrong with this child's hair? Yeah. Yeah. Dude, sure makes great meat. Yeah, they're the best meat makers in the whole world. They make pretty good milk, too. Fuck Normal. Normal. We do buy our meat That's not worth it. Yeah. Like the chicken, yeah. the corn, and the milk, and everything else you <laughs> see on the table. You mean the meat and the milk are made somewhere else? Someone yes. chats right, this and kid has Lego fact, hair. fact, it all starts <laughs> right there. You're saying that those corn plants grow up in the hamburgers and fried chicken and eggs? Well, and this milk. Eggs, the hairdressers, and held up a that. fucking sure Lego minifigure of Brom. I'll tell you what, I've got to go to the office for a couple hours. <laughs> Give me this. But if your mom His dad time, does she too. Can show you. Yeah. Well, that'll be great, all right. Please, Mom. <laughs> well, all right, but let's finish up lunch first. I'll call Brent and see if he can show you around his farm. You just have to promise me one thing, that as soon as you get back, you got to tell me everything you learned. Deal? Deal. Hey, guys. They we're straight up had uh, eggs, eggs corn, and milk, and meat for their <laughs> picnic. No, man. American, I bet American you way. I didn't realize that farming is America's biggest business. Bigger than cars and trucks? Bigger than computers? Yes, bigger than any business. And corn producers are one of the most important Somebody products. fact check this right now? Yeah, let's... <laughs> Bigger than cars and computers? Yeah, well, Japan is <laughs> Japan exists now. Corn each year. On this acreage, they will raise between eight to nine billion bushels of corn. That's enough corn to fill nine million tractor trailers and is forty-five percent of the entire world output of corn. Why are we making so much corn? Over That's two a lot billion corn. bushels of that corn gets loaded onto ships to be sold overseas. I don't think we can. <laughs> I don't, I don't needs think it. we can. Yeah. Some of that corn gets made into them. industrial products. I don't products. think we can stop For the corn example, trains rolling. Over 400 <laughs> million bushels of corn are used to make ethanol. Everybody just wants this ethanol shit for some reason. We just start growing that as a joke, but then everybody start taking it seriously. So <laughs> <laughs> but most of the corn, these guys, these guys love corn. Each year's production goes to feeding livestock. And that's what we're going to see right now. They're there. actually eating corn. Are we? <laughs> well, we're at Mr. Brent Porteous's farm. Is this Brad where they make Porteous? the meat and milk? Well, sort of, but why don't we let uh, Mr. Porteous tell us about that? Oh, that minivan. Yeah. Oh, uh, baby. Hell yeah. Speeding bullet. God, the, okay, God, the landscapes of Ohio oh, sure are boy. beautiful. <laughs> place. Everyone is saying this. Damn, they got Windows XP off in the distance. Where <laughs> Dad, you That's where they took the picture. It. I hope you learn where all that stuff in the grocery store comes from. He showed us cattle that were getting ready to go to market soon. But he has to Why make we sure get to they're as healthy as possible. They're, they're showing it now that, through flashback. He them corn. I, I, corn, I guess. Well, what makes corn so good? First of all, it's high in protein, and it's got lots of energy and nutrients. Hey, that sounds like what Mom says when she tells us why certain foods are good for us. That's what Brent told us. It's sort of like taking care of kids. They need to eat well to sounds be healthy. Sounds like an egg. They may be like <laughs> kids, but I ain't seen any of them doing homework. <laughs> <laughs> then Brent said we should go Fun see how pigs are raised, so delivery. off we went. We learned about grain entrapment. We raise 1,050 acres of corn on our farm. The corn is harvested in the fall. I forget how tall to corn the is. Grain bins you see up there. They should make it the shorter. Time, it is they got mazes. The yeah, it's no wonder. It was really nice and cool in lost. their barn. Oh, and baby! Too. Mr. Oh, Wallace. baby, that's pigs. It has to be. He keeps it cooled in the summer and heated in the winter so his pigs stay comfortable. How do they keep Eric, the pigs from post, getting hurt? Please post pig. Or sick. They put them in specially designed holders <laughs> oh, yeah. called that. pens. These pens give the pigs enough. They're, they're very conveniently oh, yeah. skirting they're around the, 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 oh, the, the yeah, bad stuff. Oh, look at those guys. Yeah. Well, if you they're, can they're try, it, they're trying Waters real hard. Suggested that we go to the Duncan family don't worry what happens to these. And see where <laughs> yeah, don't so, and did you? Don't show some yeah. of the conditions that they may be in. You know what? <laughs> they don't do homework. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Duncan told us that he would show us what happened to the milk before it goes into the carton so that we bring home But he wouldn't show us what happened to the pigs that before the bacon happens. She weighed right at pounds when she was born. In two months' time, she will double her weight. But in a time of two months' time, she will weigh 
200 pounds. At that time, we wean her from the milk. First, he showed us how they hook the cows up to get the milk. They have a machine that does what people used to do by hand. But doesn't that machine hurt the cows? Nope. Mr. Duncan told us that the cows are mine. Wow. First, he said he nope, never sure doesn't. Wow. to the animals. They love it, actually. He said that if the animals don't feel safe and protected, they won't produce as much milk or meat. And finally, he showed the kids where all the milk was stored before it was picked up to be processed and packaged. Twenty years later, he people have fucking strapped right VR there. headsets it was onto great. cows. <laughs> he explained that it was perfectly safe to drink. My it cow played through all of half of Alex. Well, that's now that's milk. Oh, Jesus. Ah, but we're not yet. <laughs> Taking a Mr. Sip. Duncan told us that there was a hatchery on our way home. Uh-oh. More eggs. Oh, yeah, we're back to the eggs. <laughs> Kids that will never eat chicken great. again. Do these little yeah. chickens eat <laughs> oh, your God. too? They sure do. I got to hold like a little chi chick chicklet, whatever the fuck they're called, when I was a kid and it shot on me. <laughs> <laughs> little bastards. Birds do do this. They I don't do know, this makes me want to eat you never seen more. cows or chickens in the store. <laughs> and I haven't heard you tell me you saw any hamburgers or meat out on the farms. Well, all the farmers explained that's because there's another stop between when the animals leave their farm and get to your grocery store. Oh, wow. <laughs> my truck wow. They didn't the talk about that stuff. That's full the smile. The last well, what's the last stop? The meat goes from the processor to the grocery store, and then you take it home. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. It's, it's magic. We it's magic. That the average American they take them into a special room, and, and the meat comes out. Don't worry, about it. Don't worry about it. And the meat processor takes The average care of American it. eats 63 pounds of beef, 46 pounds of pork, 63 pounds of poultry products. Hey, what the fuck going on drink. over there? <laughs> milk and a milk cone. Every year. That's a lot of food. <laughs> milk equivalent. Sure is, and that's why we have to raise milk a lot of corn every frozen year. Ball of milk. We drink 500 pounds of you who drink. So what's a final lesson? <laughs> Yeah, where they sell it. Uh, yeah, 70 of those pounds is, uh, is milk, all that corn 500 pounds is yoo-hoo. And I believe <laughs> that farmers have to take real good care of those animals so they can grow up healthy. And lots of people get their so jobs from helping farmers me, uh. raise, ship, and sell our food. And I learned that learning all about our food has made me hungry. Okay, okay. I guess a snack is in order. How about some ice cream? That sounds great. But we'll have to go to the store. These kids are going to yeah, watch uh, Chicken there. Run in the I early know. 2000s and become radicalized. <laughs> now, these are American kids. They're going to think it's funny and then they're going to eat more chicken. <laughs> <laughs> hey, to be fair, I've seen Chicken Run a couple, a couple weeks ago. Uh, it's still good. Really good movie. Yeah. I haven't seen it in forever. Yeah, I want to watch it again. Yeah. Good. America, America rules. We got so much corn and meat. Check this There's shit no out. repercussions to this. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should stop making corn. I don't there think we can. It. Oh no, <laughs> I forgot about this guy. Oh, it's corn meal. Corn meal. I hope you enjoy learning a little bit more about the farmers, the corn. The animals, yeah. and the corn. Overall, I think the corn was a so smoke now, screen for this video. This was this was like from, this was like rancher propaganda. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you can play as me in Mario Kart 8. <laughs> <laughs> a, I mean, there is a farm level, yeah. Moomoo Meadows. There is Moomoo yeah. Meadows. Yeah, honestly, that wasn't really that much about corn, to be honest. That really was just rancher propaganda. It sure was. It was. Yeah. There's two, so there's two corn tapes. They're on the same length. That They're what? Like nine, nine minutes each. <gasps> that one was called uh. the Corn Factory. And so that, I think, is more about the process. This one is just called, like, corn the food or something. I'm pretty sure I they're from the same... Uh, I can't believe you have two different corn tapes. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's a bundle package. It's a double feature. I still can't get over how how hard they they glaze. They just called it the processing <laughs> step. The the processing. I'm very much. Don't worry about it. Whoa. I don't think kids are allowed to you drive combine harvesters. That. <laughs> but, uh, well, uh, have you been to a farm? No, nah, that's true. Oh, that's true. That's true. <laughs> don't worry about it. It's fine. I wonder if this is just the whole tape. It's just a kid driving. That would be yeah. amazing. Yeah. Wake up. It's out.
Wait, it's the same kids. It's the same, I think it's the Billy. series. I, I didn't um, recognize him without his Lego hair. Um, yeah. Mrs. Anderson, uh, we're ready. Well, the floor is all yours. <sighs> I have to talk about corn again. What elementary school lets you have a mug? <laughs> oh, okay, it's part of his project. Never mind. It's a prop. Oh, baby, the Ohio Corn yeah. Marketing Program. Yeah. That, that would make a fast. world of difference. This is the exact okay. same concept as the egg video. Basically. They always used to school Mrs. presentations. Anderson first gave us the assignment. Well, we weren't sure where to begin. So we found that we had to work together. <sighs> well, we thought it might be best to get started right away. So, we asked Mom to take us to Wendy's. <laughs> on the way to we eat, start we could have come up with anything, and we're already getting a little, can you, well, um, Can you tell kids. about, can you tell when all the wondrous industry food. Ohio has? <laughs> <laughs> but they had the name drop, oh, Wendy's. Boy. Oh, oh boy, like Wendy's. Like she told us she had an idea. Look at that fucking <laughs> register, holy so shit. Use yeah, that's like a, that's like awesome. a soda machine. <laughs> After we finished eating, she came out and told us some interesting stuff. She told us that Wendy's had just recently switched over to frying its french fries and corn oil. And she showed us that Wendy's also used corn products and other things. You know, this is a good thing. Shows, yeah, dressing, like the meat ketchup, and the drinks and the tea and... <laughs> You know, there it's is all, here it's all corn. It's all corn, corn, baby. Our love is all the way down. Okay, come on, I'll corn, because you. Ohio is corn central, oh, they're baby. They're the fucking Wendy's. Dave, how you doing today? Oh, well, pretty good, Teresa. Now, this is Billy and Amy, and they're doing a school project on corn. I thought maybe you could help them out a little bit. Sure, I'd be glad to. Oh, he is kind maybe of wearing an Undertale shirt. You're right. This implies that, like, whatever <laughs> town these kids live in in Ohio, that, like, so Wendy's is a big enough, like, morning. business morning. in the town that, like, people just hang out there. Like, it's yeah. one of four places you can go to. It's like a lounge. <laughs> it's like two diners, two diners, a Wendy's, and the school, and the school. And lots and lots of corn. He told us he can harvest over 5,000 bushels of corn every day. He's singing song lyrics. I'm just imagining, like, a gag that's, like, this exact thing of, like, voiceover saying, we learned about this and this, and you can hear in the background the farmer is clearly talking about, like, the amount of fatalities that can happen yeah. if you're not careful. This <laughs> Billy almost fell on me a year ago. <laughs> <laughs> My job's dangerous. He's talking about hacking the firmware on his John Deere tractor. <laughs> <laughs> I watch DVDs on my tractor. It's pretty cool. Out them overhead bands. <laughs> and if you're really interested in seeing what we do with the corn, you ought to go over to Cargill Dayton and see what they do with it. Well, Mom said okay. Oh my God. This is such a fucking... Oh, let's go to, go to a different... Gill. Let's go to a different plant. <clears throat> The tour of the plant. This the plant is to protect them from the corn. corn. <laughs> Occasional, occasionally there's corn rain in Ohio. Yeah. It dumps the corn out. It's really neat to watch. They dump almost 300 trucks a day. From here, Mr. Thayer explained that the corn goes to large storage bins until they need it. When it's needed, they start it through the mill. First, he showed us how the corn is cleaned and then soaked in water. Then, they separate the corn from the soap water. Yo, that's yellow. Once the corn that's, is separated uh, from the soap water, they that's start how they make the yellow. milling process, <clears throat> where they grind mm -hmm. and separate the corn into four main products. So much yellow, Protein, everything is yellow. Fiber, oil, Stairs and yellow. starch. These four products are then processed for businesses to use. For an example, a lot of shown shows corn, but corn starch is good. That will be used to make our favorite soft drinks. The syrup is what makes the corn so sweet. So we also like, make candy syrup. I love Coca-Cola. <laughs> I love that they're wearing safety goggles. <laughs> you have to be very At careful while this man stirs corn. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can you go rewind a bit? Until when? To when they were stirring the beaker. I just gotta see that kid's fucking death stare again. I just gotta see that kid's fucking death stare again. <laughs> that kid was like intense, glaring it down. He it's was like, oh yes, <laughs> like, like, 
It's, 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 pause, pause, please. Uninterrupted. That's the face, that's the face of the kid that, like, learned what, what his soda is made out of, and this is, like, a life-changing moment for him. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, you, you can keep going. You yeah, keep going. The, the, the struggle to pause is too great on the VCR. At the end of the tour, consistency of that stuff that looks like glycerin. Gross. Every year, that's half a million acres of corn. In one day, they burn over 400 tons of coal and use 3 million gallons of water. He's gonna push them in. We also learned that one truck of farm corn. Are they just excitedly talking about how much coal they burn every day? <laughs> yeah, I was Jesus like, why are they just like, touting that? Or 1.1 million loaves of bread. Or 115,000 Like cornbread or just oh, bread? Oh, oh, bread. Stop on our in America, oh, there's, there's corn in everything. Corn there's literally, <laughs> there's just about corn in everything, yeah. Huh? In it's on its way to wind up popcorn. If you like, you can follow this truck and see how it eventually ends up on the grocery store shelf. Wait, is there, sure. like, really corn and wheat bread? Like corn byproducts. Probably. Are. Okay. Probably huh. is corn and everything we eat. That's so weird. I, I was not joking when they said when I said that we probably can't stop making corn. Yeah, like I know I know you all got corn syrup in your drinks for some fucking well I say some fucking reason like you know you all got yeah I know. <laughs> And tortilla chips. It smelled great. So I asked him what it was. Oh yeah, he I said, love Cheetos. Well, let's have a look. First what he showed us how to take the cornmeal and make cheese puffs. Then he showed us how to use the ground corn. I thought they had nachos. gone white. I know, I, I did too. <laughs> I thought they'd had like a fucking old shape. snake thing happen to them. Over the course of one shot. The room where the popcorn mm. is made. It was great. First, he showed us a huge popcorn popper. It can okay, pop you 2,000 pounds of popcorn per hour. From the popper, the corn is dropped down into a storage bin, where they can use it to make either cheese, caramel, or salted corn. They had they were making cheese corn, cheese and it smelled incredible. We got to watch the machine add the cheese flavor, and even got to taste some sure that came safe. out of the tumbler. Then we yeah. walked over to the storage warehouse Snacks and Snacks. chose more than 100,000 square feet of their products. The he thing is, anything is safe until you get injured. In a couple of days. It's true. So yeah. that it was and you can eat anything unless your body's fucked up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Unless you're not equipped really to eat it. Yeah, That's the thing, my body's hey, fucked up and I can't eat cheese popcorn anymore. I miss that. Thank you. <laughs> By the way, Marion is also the home of the Ohio Corn Marketing Association. And if you'd like to learn some more about corn, I'd be glad to make a phone call and make arrangements for you to visit with them. <laughs> sure. Jeez. I love corn marketing. Y'all better get an A. Oh, yeah, man. Y'all better so, get an A. on the way home, we stopped by the Ohio Corn Marketing I'm office. driving you around. My Wagner explained what they do. He told us that their job is to teach the public how the farm to credit farm center and conduct research on new uses for farm products. This helps increase the demand for all farm products. Then he told us some interesting facts. Yeah, like agriculture is Ohio's largest business. I don't know if it's just a video quality. This one's so red. He is he also pretty red. Told us that make them more red. <laughs> we can make them more red. It's always the use possible. Of Ethanol is made from corn, and when you mix it with gas, it reduces the amount Damn, of air Damn, whipping his corn out on corn. camera. Only one bushel of corn produces two and one half gallons of ethanol. And one acre of corn can produce enough ethanol to displace 400 gallons of imported oil. We also found out some more things at the library. They got an ethanol the shirt? Four years, ethanol <laughs> what is that behind the <laughs> kid? That, uh, that is a good <laughs> shirt. Pretty good, good shirt. Products that went no, what does it say? Ethanol <laughs> performs. I love that shirt, yeah. not gonna lie. He switched from the Undertale t shirt to the Pugsley t shirt. <laughs> he, he is very Pugsley code right now. No, it's Ness t shirt. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is Ness. Oh, you're right. He needs a red hat. Oh, yeah, you're right. That's 94 in the US and 34 in other countries. So. After learning all of this, we feel that corn is the most important thing that we use every day. <laughs> You're right, unfortunately. Oh, well, Billy, Amy, I'm and impressed. We can't stop. But aren't you forgetting your special guest? Oops. Yes, Billy forgot about the special guest we brought. Come here, Kalua. Come here. Come on, Kalua. It's that Come fucking on. guy in the corn shirt again. Yeah. The corn outfit. Oh, no, okay. 
This dog was made out of corn. They all got corn totes. <laughs> Damn. They're really oh trying to that they egg. Do. Wait, what? What does the dog have to do with corn? <laughs> why is this happening? A corn dog, maybe? And Billy, are you going to tell the class why you yeah. invited Kahlua today? Oh, yeah. <gasps> Even dog food has corn in it. <laughs> what? Oh, Jesus. Okay. See, that I'm less surprised. What did, he, what did he even say? He said because dog food has corn in it. Oh, okay. That's why they brought the dog in. I thought for a split second the kid said, the dog knows the coordinates. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> was like what on earth? The dog knows the coordinates, effing all problems. Holy shit, that would have been the greatest possible ending for an educational film. <laughs> the dog knows the coordinates. No further elaboration. The dog knows the coordinates. <laughs> Aw, yeah. <laughs> all right. There's one more tape. Is it about food? It's not about food. It is about safety. Okay. And I felt we should always wrap up. Now that we've learned about all these things, we are all connected through the internet. We should always wrap up knowing exactly how we can be safe on the internet. There's, we can never be too safe. So I oh, feel yeah. like, uh, if especially if any sort of celebrities could tell me about this, I feel like I'd understand it a lot oh. more. Mm -hmm. So, I think it's time. To learn about internet safety, but not just how to use the internet. We are proud to present this video introduction to online safety. As you know, the internet has made its way into millions of American homes and schools. Our kids are growing up online, learning more than ever online. Yeah. And our students are becoming smarter. They're talking about us. And just as we yeah. all learned how to that act safely and responsibly in the real world, we need to be alert and informed in cyberspace. Until the rules of online safety are as recognizable as the flashing don't walk signs, these tips will help us surf a little safer. There is a wonderful world of opportunities on the web, like being part of a virtual classroom 24 hours a day. And we want to make the most of it. But we need to make sure we all know I tried sure to teach in a virtual classroom to stop COVID. I had to quit my job. So cue us <laughs> grab your keyboard. It is somewhat became more, this, this thing became more relevant somehow with time. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Triceratops. Triceratops. <clears throat> MTV. Homework help. I'm I miss those these yeah like on the AOL dude. homepage with all the buttons. Yeah. Safe surfing. Safe hey, surfing. Safe surfing. <laughs> Starring God. Tim Smith from Home Improvement. The, the phrase "safe surfing" was already Jeremy making me think of the generic YMD drive-in ads, <laughs> and then they said that in the exact same cadence. Irene Ung from the Mystery Files of Shelby Woo. Fucking hell. And Eddie Jones of the Los Angeles Lakers. What? This is the oh. weirdest. This is the weirdest collection of like of like not main character. This is this is the weirdest collection of like not celebrity celebrities. Even do your homework. We got an Olympic gold medalist, a uh, Los Angeles Laker, uh, some, some guy in Home Improvement. Oh, saw the boom mic up top there. Did you know you yep. gotta be careful what you do and where you go out there in cyberspace? Well, Honestly, I saw this was the guy from Malcolm in the Middle for a second. Safe Malcolm in now, cyberspace. Don't put your age and location in your Twitter bio. Yeah. <laughs> See, yeah, a lot of these rules have been they... lost. <laughs> yeah, yep, yeah. they sure have. This is what I was thinking when they were starting to like starting up with that shit. Like, oh yeah, like when like hopefully one day the 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 rules of online safety was well known as like don't walk signs and shit. Uh, no, we don't have that. <laughs> Still don't. If anything, it's gotten worse. Yep. Paparazzi! Folks will go into an 18 rated space with 13 in their bio and act strange when they get banned. Like. I don't know. Oh, hey! 
Uh, you guys want to see this gif of a dragon fucking a car? <laughs> <laughs> uh, there it is. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, oh, right. Internet safety. Right, right. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm Sabrina the Teenage Witch. It's just a character that I play. <laughs> I'm not really. Look, really. it's Sabrina's band. Oh, that's who oh, she right. plays. She plays oh, the Oh, yeah. Bitch, the bitch that, totally oh, that hated Sabrina for no yeah. reason or whatever. Not totally different. We both love clothes. I like how she had to assure it. It's just a character I play. It's I'm not actually a, a bad person. I'm not evil. <laughs> Hey, are they gonna have um, the cat of played Salem on here? That's the 708. That That'd be sick. Better delete it. Save something. Sure thing. You should Oh, this one's this one's been lost to time. Oh yes, yeah, for sure. I broke that rule today. <laughs> Anyways, you should all go to Steer and Community right now. <laughs> Vote for my favorite CS:GO team. <laughs> Just what I wanted. See, Three you've games in chat. Go, and what to stay clear of. Take a look, y'all. <laughs> Damn, Carrie. That laptop! You know that these have oh my yeah. goodness, I just yeah. saw the ports Chunky. at the back here. So Here's how. Just like that, a lot of you that out here, laptop I like is like. That laptop is out. as big as. as thick as a I briefcase. Yep. I still have one of those. Oh, this one's definitely <laughs> been lost to time. This is, uh, yeah, yeah, that's uh, <laughs> been nice. something that makes me feel funny. I think a lot of people need to relearn this one, honestly. Always tell a parent, teacher, or other nearby adult about any threatening or bad Bad language. Oh, no. Bad language. Oh, my God. You gotta watch out. If someone says the F word at you, someone just swore in the YTV chat. <laughs> yeah, you'd all be done for. <laughs> I love being on set. I love being on set. I love movies. And cut. Hollywood. And cut. And cut. Hi, I'm Irene Ng from the Mystery Files of Shelby Wu. What? That's it. I remember the show. You know, Shelby's not the only one who likes digging around for facts and information. In real life, I go online all the time to explore ideas about my other love, the field of medicine. Hell yeah. This? Nice. This is what it, yeah. this is what this DNA is looks like. Yeah. I'm learning so much logging on this look at a gif. It's my DNA There are a few things though. It's just as easy as med school. Save surfing. This one's a DNA fan page. Never give Hell up yeah. personal information uh, about yourself to someone well, on a hey. or bulletin. This one is yeah. all this one's so all basically been a bullet. Mm -hmm. This one's been mm -hmm. obliterated. All of these yeah. rules except mm -hmm. number one, which is don't share your password. Nobody does these in your phone. Everyone forgot. Twitter will straight up ask you for your phone number, your address, and what city you live in. Sorry, Irene. We're ready for your close-up. People will go on Twitter and put their age in their bio. Like, people will go on Twitter and in ask bio. People will go on Twitter and be like, yo, I'll, I'm gonna fight you. Meet me here. Yeah. <laughs> there are people that'll make their Twitch accounts username their phone number. Oh, yeah, we've seen that. <laughs> yeah. We've seen that, yeah. Those are the best. That's fucking wild. I'm Eddie Jones of Los Angeles. I thought I'd take the time out. Check I don't out think it's safe to check, check your emails with all these people looking over your Yeah, shoulder. I don't know. It's breaking yeah. a lot of rules there. I met some good friends online, but there are all kinds of people out there. And remember, you have to be your own defensive There are all guard. kinds of freaks online. <laughs> be on defense. That's rule six. Never say you'd be someone in person without first acting your parent, teacher, or some other responsible adult. There's millions of people out there in cyberspace. You can't be really sure of who you're chatting with. Keep your guard up and you're always... Yeah, and they're not all going to be as cool as uh, a basketball player. <laughs> oh! 
sick web page. Hey, what were those tips again? Never give out your password or other personal information to anyone online. No one does this anymore. Wild, this is guys, no this is absolutely this broken. This is just the <laughs> if you encounter bad language or cure threatening online, leave the chat room or log off. And then tell a parent or teacher. And log never say on. you'll log log someone in person side without touch first grass. getting permission from your parent or teacher. For more information, log Ooh, on Ooh, I really website. hope this is still up. I bet it's not. Oh, check that one out. Ah, uh, Yahoo's redirecting no, me. Damn it. Man. Hey, it's me, Taren, again. What you a fucking good loss. Advice, huh? I mean, most people out there in cyberspace I'm are just like base. you and me. But you should still surf safely. Hope you keep it in mind next time you go online. See you in cyberspace. Hey, being pad located. Thanks, America Online. That was it. Great. With that this knowledge, good. with this knowledge, I hope we can all use the internet safely until the next VHS viewings. <laughs> uh, good Make luck sure with that. Remember these rules. <clears throat> Remember how many tons of corn are produced, and the fact that America can't stop. We can't. <laughs> that was it. So those are the tapes for tonight. Wonderful. Hope y'all enjoyed the tapes. And uh, oh, there's an archived link to the website. I do want to check oh, that. Shit. Can someone post it in the chat? I think someone did. <laughs> Literally just breaking a rule right now. <laughs> Can someone post a link in the oh, yeah. chat? Oh yeah, HR, HR posted it. Crouton. Oh hell net. yeah! Oh, this looks oh great. God, I'm not rules. clicking on crouton.net. <laughs> 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 oh wow, it's yeah. This is like the up to date page. Oh hey, it's like it's got all yeah, the. It's, it's very well preserved. It's got the pages from the celebrities and everything. Wow, sick. I well, love the, when you you hover over the links, it does like a little dance. Yeah, it's great. Nice, nice and animated. Safe surfing. Well. There you go. You've got this to refer to if ever you forget the tips yeah. that we heard in these tapes. I will uh I will leave you all <laughs> on that note. <laughs> Jesus, the links. Enough links. Don't go to unsafesurfing.com. Don't go there. <laughs> don't, don't go to ebombsworld.com. All right. So that was it. Thank you, you all have learned your lesson about just putting two different <laughs> words dot com in yeah in we <laughs> <laughs> we've had some experiences with that uh thank you thank you for watching thank you everyone in the discord for uh for watching tapes with me i appreciate it thank you and uh and we'll see y'all maybe at the end of march the last day the last day of march is a thursday so it might be a vhs viewing day so. Ooh. Might be a special, yeah. special two, two in one month. They'll probably be the same length. I think this is a good length. But, anyways, thank you. And uh, I'm gonna hop out in the Discord if y'all want to say bye. Yippee! Bye. Bye. Oh, here's that bye. Gift, by the way. There's that gift. All right, I'll I'll look at it right now. Awesome. <laughs> Sick. All right. Oh my goodness, the roaring of the tape. All right. So that was VHS viewings for. February that got delayed is not over. Remember, I mentioned there were some announcements. Let me bring up some music as we wrap up. I mean, some announcements. It's the new merch items that are on the store now, actually. Just some fun, funky items for you to check out if you so please. Let's take a look over here. The first item. It's a variant. It was a it was a design by Dead in Miami that wasn't used at the initial launch of the store. But if you want some sort of a variant on the special presentation shirt, the piece from above shirt, the the two sided shirt, this is a one sided variant with a different slightly different design. If you so if you so enjoy it, you can get it in either t-shirt or sweater format. So that's one of the shirts that is on the store now. Designed courtesy of Dead in Miami. And now these shirts are, are my designs. We'll see. <laughs> the next shirt 
is the is the I love my bedtime shirt. So if you need positive self affirmations, if you if you want to feel excited about your bedtime, then you could get this shirt that says I love going to bed at a reasonable time. I made this so that I could feel good about my own bedtime, and um, <laughs> and you get to you get to share that that feeling with the world if you want it. Um, so this is my reminder when I when I see this shirt, I go, oh, you know what? I really love you know what? 2 a.m. 3 a.m. for me is the time. 2 a.m. 3 a.m. I feel good. 4 a.m. I start to feel a little bit, a little bit bad. So if I see this shirt, I go, oh, I should really go to bed at two or three, not four. So this isn't, you know, your, your, your bedtime, your reasonable time is your reasonable time. And this is a positive affirmation to stick to that time. So this shirt is up now on the merch store. Uh, that is one of the shirts. Let me check to see if it's, it's already in the store, but I tried to bump it up to the top. So it should be there if you go to merch sockpens.com you will see all the new items are at the top so the I love my bedtime shirt and sweater are both there and the last shirt a question a question we've seen that had never been answered and we still don't really know the answer but the question itself contains true and valuable meaning is the, the what did poopoo do wrong shirt so if you've ever asked yourself this this is the shirt i like the design it does have poopoo on it so <laughs> i'm gonna be i'm gonna I, I, i'm gonna be getting myself one of these as well so we'll be we will be uh, uh wearing it in solidarity so if you've ever, you know, if you've ever seen Gobbler and you've asked yourself, what did Poopoo do wrong? This shirt, this shirt could lead you to an answer. You never know who could come up to you and give you the answer. So this shirt, and it's also in a sweater format. All of this, all of the new shirts are also in sweater format because I think sweaters are fun. So you could see these new designs are all up on the merch store now. It will be up until the end of April, where the current, and all of the older items are also still there. So all of the Channel 17 stuff, the New Year's shirt, the You Dead shirt, the Awuga shirt, the Benny Blobs, the Peace, Peace From Above, those are all still up, but these new items have been added. And, uh, my favorite one of this entire bunch, I think, is the I love going to bed at a reasonable time. That was, that was a shirt that was created at, uh, that was a shirt that was created at 3 a.m. <laughs> and, uh, and, and I, and I love it. It was, it was me. It was 3 a.m. and I was going, I love going to bed at 3 a.m. You know what? I think. I think I think we, I think we need it. So it said it's incredibly funny that's in such small writing. I wanted it to be, you know, subtle. You know, it's like a it's like a, you know, like a it's a comfort thing, you know, you're like I love going to bed at a reasonable time. It makes it yeah, it makes it tasteful. Even you could see a little detail here. In this one, you see in the design the WSKR and the channel 17 there's a little dot between them. But if you look at the I love my bedtime shirt, the dot is a heart because I love going to bed at a reasonable time. So, <laughs> so these are the new shirts that are up on the merch store. Pick them up if you think they're cool. Shout out to Dead in Miami for the uh, Lunchables Hearts design that is uh, that exists in the form of the special presentation variant T-shirt. All the items are on the merch store now. And so when when you have time or if you like them, feel free to visit the merch store and pick them up. Someone was asking earlier, do I sell skirts? No, but that is a possibility at some point. Something is going to be happening either in May or June 
where the there will be a, a, a change up in the store that will be uh, make that somewhat possible if the demand is there. There will be a bit more flexibility at that point. That is that is still under wraps. Those plans are under wraps, but something something is happening. So yes, and a hat, of course, the hat, the hat, ha a hat is something that's going to be happening soon as well. That is something that I really want to make sure because the hats are custom, you know, they're custom made. So I really want to make sure it's good. Because a shirt is a shirt and a sweatshirt. Those are pretty reliable. You just print on a shirt, but a hat could, you know, you want to make it's going to be on your head. You want to make sure it looks nice. So the hat, the hat is in the works, along with other items. But for now, whether you love going to bed at a reasonable time, whether you're asking yourself what did Poopoo do wrong, or whether you're enjoying a Channel 17 special presentation, these items are on the store for your enjoyment. And that bring what song is this? I've been pretty much the whole stream. I've been playing the uh, Bomberman 64 soundtrack. Cold shoe, cold shoe could be could be made as well. We'll have we'll have to look into a cold shoe. So yeah, thank you for showing up to VHS viewings. I love doing these. Uh, hopefully, we will be able to do one at the end of March. March thirty first is the last Thursday of the month, so there might be a VHS viewings then. That's in two and a half weeks. And as usual, if you want to keep an eye out to see what future streams occur, you could hop into the Discord. If you're over 16, that is where all the announcements for streams are posted. That is where you will get the most information. And of course, Twitter, Instagram, all that stuff, sock pens, uh, I post there as well. But most reliably for stream announcements, the Discord is where you'll find that. The next stream, I'm not quite sure when it'll be. It might be Wednesday, or it might be Tuesday. Uh, either Tuesday or Wednesday. And uh, you'll have to stay tuned to see what it is. Thank you for watching. Thank you for showing up. Thank you for the subs, for the donuts, for the bits. For the follows, any support is appreciated. Look at all these wonderful people in the studio. Walter's there kicking his foot up. And I will see y'all in a few days. Have a good beginning of the week. Enjoy your Sunday night. See you soon. Peace.